Hello Internet! In this video I want to show you a bug I came across in Power BI which is really nasty and I'm going to show you how it works and how to solve it. So for that I have here already my data set in my navigator and I want to import the orders TBL from in this case my Excel file. So I go to transform here and the original problem is inside the Power Query editor. So you can see here I have an order date. Now the order date currently is not correct to classify it as date. You can see there's AB3123, uh, which means it's just an arbitrary file type. Power BI is not able to recognize this as a date. Now of course if I would convert this directly now into a date, that would not work because I have this ampersand signs here between the numbers. So I need to fix this. Now what I did and what most people do of course is then go to the table itself, or in this case to the column, and then go to uh, under the transform tab or directly under home, there's both replace values. So if you click here, you see that there's a value to find and then replace with. So a typical find and replace. So of course we could simply then search for, I would like to use the ampersand and I want to replace it with a dot, right? In order to have the same date as in all the other rows and then I can convert it into an, a proper date. So that's at least what I thought. Now if I click okay, um, you'll see that nothing happens. So the replacer step has taken place. I can also see the code up there, but nothing happened in here. So why is that? Well, the problem is the arbitrary file type up here. So the AB3, 1, 2, 3, this is an issue. And as long as there is no data type, then the replacer does not work correctly. That is the bug. So how to fix it? Well, it's quite easy. What we do is, let me just replace this here, remove it, and then go in here and convert this into a text. So by doing this, you see that now it's left aligned, which is the same as in Excel, for instance. And now if I try this again, if I go to replace values, click on this one, and now I'm searching for the ampersand. Now I'm clicking on the dot. And watch what happens with this specific cell in here. I click on OK, and you see that now it has been replaced. And now next, if I go to the ABC here, click on date, and I convert it, you see that now I have my proper date. You can also see the icon up here, and now I can continue doing my data transformation and then import my data into Power BI. So hopefully you enjoyed this trick. If you came across a similar issue, now you know how to fix it. If you enjoyed this content, please give this video a like. Also, thanks so much for watching, and please subscribe to the channel. See you next time.